Hey YouTube, thanks for checking out LibaView. Today I'm gonna to talk about my cases and the stuff that it holds. This is a Case Maddox, and this is probably one of the biggest cases at the best price that I could find. This is a hard case. Um, it has some real positive latches that are on it. It has the ability for two separate locks if you need to lock this up, maybe one with a cable and then the other have a lock or run a cable through here and then lock the system up. But the nice thing about these cases is it comes with the foam insert, which like most of them do, but this foam insert has that pull and plug. It's, it's all divided up in little divisions to where you just pull out the ones that you need. Now, if you have an item that's very shallow, um, once you pull out the plug, the area that you want to recess something into, um, what you do is you just cut the foam in half and then put it back down in the hole. Um, and when I say in half, you know, these plugs are about that deep and they're just squares. So whenever you pull it out, clip it with scissors and put it back down in there. That way your stuff's not falling so deep you can't get it. Uh, like I've got AA batteries on some of my other things, which I'll show you the other case. And it's nice because I can just pull out one of these plugs and they all fit in there just great. So they hold the AA batteries, uh, they're rechargeable. So I don't have to worry about it. Uh, the case is very well built. Uh, again, the link will be down below for it. And uh, quite honestly, I wasn't familiar with this brand with the first case that I got. After I got it, I really kind of wish that I had nothing but these cases to store all my gear. Um, I do have a backpack that I've done a review on in the past and I love the backpack. It has so many compartments but I really like the fact that I can throw these around. I mean, they do take some abuse and I've got some sensitive equipment in my other. So let me show you what it looks like with some of the stuff inputted or the way that you can break it down and put inside the case here. So I've had this case for a little while now and we'll go ahead and open it up and you can see everything fits in there real nice. I have quite a bit of stuff behind these things. Uh, so they all fit like all the cables and accessories for the zooms. Uh, my Rode mic that I'm currently uh, videoing with and using for audio, uh, that goes in here. I have a uh, filmmaker kit, a Rode wireless filmmaker kit uh, for wireless microphones, that's in there. Of course, you know, the uh, dead cat for this microphone whenever we're outside. Uh, a battery charger for double A's that are rechargeable. I also have a USB powered charger. Um, and then of course other accessories, all my lavalier mics, everything like that. So this is pretty much set up for just sound equipment, but you can see I, I really beat this up. Um, I've got some Velcro that sticks up in here. I use that to hold on camera sometimes. So uh, just leave it in the case and extra cables, uh, the length of cable that I use to go from the microphone here to the camera. Uh, all that stuff fits in here so there's quite a bit of room and I did make provisions here um, in the future if I want to I'm going to remove these microphones and these openings are just as big uh, as these here uh, so I can again get another set in case I want to mic up a separate person um, and have two people that are talking but it does a great job and I love it again the links down below for this so feel pretty confident I mean you can see the size on this um, I don't really have any kind of measurements for it. Of course, it's going to include that in the description. So uh, click the link below. It'll take you right to it. Look it over, see what you can get for a price on it, and you'll be happy that you do. If you're looking for a case and you're wanting a hard case, this one does a great job. Is it waterproof? It doesn't say anything about being waterproof. Um, quite honestly, I don't plan on going rafting with this. I don't plan on leaving it out in the rain. I just need something that I can throw inside my camper or in the back of my truck and not have to worry about it getting damaged or squashed if I throw more in there. So this does the job. Appreciate you guys watching. Thanks a lot. Bye.